Yeah, absolutely. I go to parks. Pearson Park, which is just a couple blocks away from my house, and I go there a lot. Yes, absolutely. Yes, I go to parks. I always have a park to go to. There's like five around my house. A lot of my friends are there. Visiting parks, it's usually very like nice, and you get like lots of vitamin D, and you get to see many animals and birds and hear nice sounds, and it's very comforting. Well, I like to fish. A lot of my other friends like to count the trees. We usually have a game of how many, whoever can count the highest number of trees. It gives me time to walk my dogs to the park and hang out with friends and be more active. I can go swimming, or there's a library, uh, places to eat, watch fireworks, we can go fishing, we can go bicycling, we can do anything like that. Couples holding hands and stuff like that. Just enjoy nature, sit back, watch, you know, listen, you can explore. I watch squirrels in clouds sometimes. You can't watch TV or play video games or stuff a lot of kids nowadays like to do. You can't play video games and you can't like Instagram or Facebook or anything like that. You can't sit around and watch TV or play video games. You have to kind of be active and that's a good thing. At parks you can't be lazy, like you're always doing something to keep your body flowing. I think it's actually good going out where there's no Wi-Fi. A lot of apple trees. In the winter, I build snowmans and do snow angels, and then I have snow fights with my friends. Yeah, here in Canada, we're lucky to have the four seasons, so you're always getting to see a different background on the parks, not just summer or winter. You see fall and spring and everything in between. I think people should spend some time outside just because then you'll absorb nature more, and you'll actually be a part of nature if you're outside. Fresh air is good for all of us, doesn't matter who you are. In the fall, I always like jump in leaf piles. People might not go outside because of allergies. I think people should spend time outside because not too many people nowadays do. And the ones that I do see outside are all saying, wow, ooh, look at this. And it's not just a normal, regular thing they see every day. I would just say, hey, let's go to the park and go to the splash pad or something and not stay inside. Not a lot keeps me from going outside. It doesn't matter if it's raining, snowing, if it's cold or really hot, I still go out. I think it is very important to protect some parts of the world because we don't want too much overdevelopment. A lot of places that are being cut down, like forest-wise, they have a lot of species that aren't anywhere else in the world. I think we should protect the oceans because if we spill oil in them, all the animals will go extinct. Yeah, we should protect the oceans. It's an important part of our ecosystem, and without it, a lot of things would get screwed up. I think it's very important for the ecosystem, too. We only know 10% about what's going on in them. The main thing people don't do and don't think of is letting their garbage go. Like, plastic bags is the worst. They let their plastic bags go, they will get caught in the air, and when it lands in the ocean or in any sea, if the movement of the bag in the water looks like a live fish. So other fish will come up and they will eat that, and that it will kill them. It'll get stuck in their gills and it will kill them. Recycle more, just like, so then all of this doesn't go back into the ocean. Recycle more and be more knowledgeable about what's happening in the oceans. Recycling, that's a big one. And if you are at a beach or an ocean of some sort, make sure to pick up all your garbage when you leave and don't leave it laying around.